I'm here today because I have something really exciting to share with you. If you are one of our subscribers, uh, you're probably familiar with our show on Facebook Live on Tuesday nights at 9 p.m. It's called WDW 101. Tatiana and I take turns hosting that event and it's for our subscribers only. So if you're not a subscriber, go to www-magazine.com and get your subscription. You can start right today. It's $4 a month, really easy. With that, you get to come watch us on Tuesday nights and we talk about stuff on the issue. We talk about seasonal events at WDW. Uh, we answer lots of questions, but now we have a sponsor and they are Expedition Roasters. And if you know anything about me and Tatiana, it's that we love coffee almost as much as we love Disney. If you haven't heard about Expedition Roasters, they're a coffee roasting company and all of their blends are themed to attractions at WDW and Disneyland. So that's basically a Steph match made in heaven, right? So today I'm going to be unboxing all of the coffee they sent to me to drink over the next few months because I need to fuel up if I'm going to be doing these Facebook Live videos at 9 p.m. And I want to try out all these flavors for you. So uh, let's just get to it. Uh, they sent me this big box. It's like, it's really heavy. Um, and I think that there's 12 different coffees inside. So let's take a look. Okay, so let me just show you. <laughs> it's filled up to the brim with coffee. I can't wait. Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh, a little sticker. Oh, I don't even know where I'm going to put it. I think I'm going to put it on my coffee tasting journal notebook. Uh, yes, I have a coffee tasting journal notebook because you know how much I love coffee. It's so cute. I just, I love all of their artwork and you know that I'm such a big Adventureland fan. So having kind of the Adventureland theme uh, to their artwork is just amazing. They sent this amazing little postcard and it's like a little telegram. Oh, dear intrepid explorer, thank you for purchasing some of the finest coffees from around the world. Oh, something that I wanted to tell you, I was reading all about uh, Expedition Roasters online and they are, uh, premium Arabica beans and they're all certified allergen free and gluten free. So if that's really important to you, in addition to having Disney themed coffee, um, you're in luck because it's all safe. Okay, let's take a look at what they sent me. Okay, first thing, so cute, so cute. The artwork is amazing on all of these packages. This one is uh, Expedition Roasters Roundup Roast Campfire S'mores Blend. Okay, Toy Story Land just opened. I haven't been yet. I'm really jealous of everybody who's been and this might just tide me over until I go see it in November. It's all cowboy print. There's like a beautiful, like almost like a, like a soft touch coating on these bags and they're really big hefty bags of coffee. Um, it's 12 ounces of coffee, it's ground coffee, and I know that they have some kind of plain flavors like a morning blend and a dark blend, but all of the flavored coffees like this one, uh, they tell me that they're very lightly flavored so you get both the delicious coffee bean flavor and the flavor flavor. So in this case, Campfire S'mores. I cannot wait to try this one. Okay, what's next? Oh, my husband's gonna love this. I mean, I'll love it too because it's Star Wars, but Dark Side Roast, amazing. How beautiful is this packaging? Just makes me wanna like hop on a ship to a galaxy far, far away. And after I drink all this coffee, that's probably how I'll feel because I will be very awake. Oh, this is beautiful. This is a ghoulish delight cinnamon bun flavor. I know how much everybody loves the Haunted Mansion. I love the Haunted Mansion too. It's probably the most popular ride at Disneyland or Disney World. It has such a big cult following. Oh, guys, there's little skulls in the side. That's so cute. I wanna say something about the artwork too. All of the artwork on these packages um, they're done by different people and the artist is named on all of the back. So you can kind of learn a little bit about the artist and maybe go check them out. I think that that's so neat. Oh, I love it. Oh, this one. If you're a Cars Land fan from Disneyland, Route 66 Tire Fix Morning Blend. Open seven days, we never tire. So cute. They even have the little California Route 66 crest there. Oh, well, their tagline is brew your happy place. And uh, I think that's exactly what's gonna happen because Disney and coffee, that's my happy place. Oh. Me. 
Main Street Columbia. I love this. It's simple. It's elegant. It reminds me of like the Starbucks locations in uh, Disneyland and Disney World and how they have all those like copper uh, utensils and everything hanging on the wall and they have a little bit of that patina on them. Amazing. Oh, Enchanted Tiki Coconut. Oh, and there's a little, there's a little tiki in the side. Oh, and there's a little tiki on the back. And a little tiki bird. Oh, he's so cute. And like coconut, right? Like coconut's my favorite flavor. I can't wait to drink that. I bet you that one's going to be so good iced. We're in popsicles. Let's make popsicles. Oh, coffee popsicles, coconut coffee popsicles. Okay, oh, Skipper's Brew Jungle Banana Pie flavor. That sounds like breakfast to me. Jungle Banana Pie coffee for breakfast. Oh, look at the details on here. Oh, Adventureland Buddies, cute. Okay, what else? Oh, another Adventureland. Well, if you're in if you're in Disneyland, Fortune and Glory bourbon streusel flavor. So this is themed to Indiana Jones. Oh, there's a little there's a little fedora and a little whip on the back. Now, um, in Disneyland, there's the Indiana Jones Adventure Attraction, and in Disney World, it's over at Disney's Hollywood Studios, but it's the Indiana Jones Epic Stunt Spectacular. Oh, this one might be my favorite might be my favorite just saying okay next this one will be Tatiana's favorite because you know how much she loves pirates it's redhead rum flavor oh, there's a little kiss on the inside how cute is that now there's a lot of controversy over the redhead she recently changed she used to be getting auctioned off now she's Looting and booting and whatever pirates do, um, but I like her either way, and I think this coffee is gonna be great. Ooh, how great is all of this? You know what? I've noticed there's, you know, I think that there's, there. Oh, this is a little cactus. There's little art on all the insides, and I missed all the other ones. Oh, so cute, guys. <gasps> well, I might not show you them all, but I'll show you them every week on WDW 101. Amazing. Oh, another Haunted Mansion. See, I told you, Haunted Mansion is just the most popular. Another Haunted Mansion one. This is Happily Never After, uh, themed to the bride from Haunted Mansion. And it's New Orleans Praline flavor. That is just beautiful. And look at this spider web cup on the back. Oh, and the side is the wallpaper, guys. <gasps> if you like that wallpaper, Stay tuned to October because we have an interesting promotion coming your way. Okay, this, this one, this is the second to last one. This is fudge brownie flavor, fudge brownie flavor. And it is bobsled blend themed to um, actually one of my favorite rides, which is the Matterhorn bobsleds at Disneyland. It's the first Disney coaster. Um, it's really beautiful. It's really iconic in the park. It's got this whole like Swiss theme and uh, you can see all of these little details, these little like Swiss, I don't know if it's called rosemalling in Switzerland, but it would be in Norway, like in Frozen, but so cute. And this one, this one might be my favorite packaging, is just so beautiful. It is the last one, it's chocolate raspberry, simply sinful. Isn't that just beautiful? It's that classic villain green and purple. It looks so evil. It's got a Maleficent kind of like crest on it, like her little horns, all these dragony scales. Oh, so beautiful. Oh, and the spinning wheel. Yes, it's true. Um, you know how much I love Sleeping Beauty. It's probably my favorite classic film uh, from w, or from Walt Disney Studios. And oh, I just can't get over how cute this packaging is. 
So that's what they've sent me so far, guys. I know that they have some um, fall, like a pumpkin version coming out uh, in the fall and probably something coming out for Christmas. And maybe I'll get to try those too, we'll see. Um, but I'm gonna be trying all of these every single week. So I hope that you join us over on WDW 101 to find out more. And in the meantime, you can go to our website at wdw-magazine.com, become a subscriber or go and search for Expedition Roasters on there because you never know, you might find a little discount or a big discount. So go check it out. Thanks guys. Um, if you wanna see more unboxing videos, comment on this one below because maybe we'll do a few more fun unboxings for you. Thanks so much, bye.